Good afternoon. Welcome to your Wednesday. And Erin, going to start it off with some flowers. I got you. Fake flowers from the... What? Hang on a minute. These are real flowers, Mikey. Yeah. How did you... What did you... Well, OK. The... Look, they're actually just a byproduct of an experiment that we're doing. Yeah. Oh. It's called the vascular plant circulation experiment. Oh, yeah, what he said. Yeah. So to get the flowers looking pretty, what you want to start by doing is filling your cups with coloured water. So we've got a bit of blue and red there. And put in your white carnations. White flowers makes it easier to see. And after about one to two days, especially after three days, you'll notice a huge colour change. And we've done some on the other side, which we've cut the stem in half and put them in two different colours of water, meaning you get two different colours on one carnation. And the reason that happens is because we all know that plants give out oxygen and use carbon dioxide. The places happens are in the tiny cells um, the openings called stomatas. They're actually found on the leaves of the plants and they open up to release oxygen or take in CO2. And when they do that, water is pushed out and evaporated. <gasps> That's so intelligent. Oh. It blows my mind. I'm just standing here. Yep. Um, but that doesn't explain how the water goes up the plant. Well, true. Um, imagine water as little magnets. It's a polar substance, so it attracts water molecules. They attract to each other. So once one leaves and evaporates, the other gets pushed up from the bottom. I think I got that. Amazing mm. instructions are on our website. Try it at home. For now, though, watch some action with Back at the Barnyard. On the Air and Simpson Show. Today, we're at the circuits for some amazing acrobatics. You could score yourself all five One Direction dolls. And Lady Six's new album has just dropped, so we take a listen.